Okay, here's a video. This is a video how to stay nice and safe on your computer. So what I have here is a web page and as you can see here my credentials are saved in here which is nice and convenient because then I just click log in and I log in. So that's okay if you or just one or two people use your computer and only people that you trust use your computer. If anybody else uses your computer never ever 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 never save your credentials like this. Did I say never? So I'll tell you why. I'll show you why. So if I right click and I say, um, let's get that up here. I can't see what I'm doing. Uh, inspect. And this pops up. And what I'm going to do, as you see, I hover over things and different things um, highlight. If I move down and move around, what I'm looking for is something that says password. And if I look around, I actually might have to do um, so there's it says password. And that's not what exactly I'm looking for. All right. This is what I'm looking for. So it says input ID equals ID password type password. And so I'm right in here. So if I hover over there, um, tells you what I'm doing. So if I mess with this, if I hit delete or backspace, I backspace and I took the word password out of there. Now if I click somewhere else over here, my password just popped up. So why is that bad? If I'm a bad guy, I now have your password. So I can copy that down. If you're like a lot of people, you use the same password for multiple accounts. And so once I got one password, I can go to other accounts and use that same password. So if you're watching this video, you might as well not try this password because I'm going to change it here in about two minutes. So Go ahead and try if you want. Plus this account, this uh, web page I used was to paying bills when we lived in Utah, which we don't use anymore. All right, so I hope you found that useful. Remember, don't save your credentials in your web browser unless only you or you or another person that you really, really trust that needs those passwords are using that computer.